Hi, Chris from Bipro here. Today I'm going to show you how to analyze your win rate in your games. First place I'm going to take you for this is Custom Workspace Mechanics. And I'm going to first select my custom event mission for your game. This might be battle or level or race or goodness knows what. And I'm going to break this down by the custom parameters I have number, which increases incrementally regardless of type of mission that they're playing. Very good to track nonlinear gameplay in as linear a way as possible. And I'm also going to select the custom parameter status, which is going to tell me win or loss. And I'm going to choose stacked, and I'm going to go apply. And what I can see here is visualization on per mission played, what the outcome of that mission was. As we can see here, we have failed complete, failed complete, failed complete, across all types of missions by mission number. Now, let's say you have an internal system for measuring difficulty in your game and you want to determine how much of an impact that difficulty is having on the outcome of win-loss. Uh, in my game, I'm going to add the additional uh, parameter to break down by called difficulty. And I'm going to run that again. Now, sorting by mission number and looking at mission three as an example, I can see that of those that failed, um, many failed at a difficulty of minus one, um, 0 0.4, 0 0.8, in fact, many failed at zero. Uh, most that did failed at zero. Uh, and the same is to be said for those that completed. And I can see that trend line all the way down across all mission numbers. And that is how you can go about measuring win rate in your games and also analyzing how difficulty balance is impacting the win rates in your games.